Hey, David, I wanted to congratulate you on the reviews that you have with this listing. I know how competitive the category can be, so to see the ratings you have is really a job well done. Now, my job is to look for potential opportunities with sellers who prioritize on Amazon. And if it's okay with you, I'd like to show you a few opportunities I found with your listing. My name is Sean, and I'm an account manager with my Amazon guy. So listen, I'm going to pack this full of valuable information. It's designed to help grow sales. I'll get through the listing in just a second. But the first thing I want to talk about are your keywords. So we utilize this tool to look at your sponsored and organic keywords, and I'm noticing that they're really low. So you've got 29 sponsored, 1,315 organic keywords. Now we recommend a one to two ratio here. So for every one sponsored, we, uh, you have two organic. But let's see of the keywords that you have, how you're performing. So I'm going to sort these by the most frequently searched keywords. So weight loss shows up first, fiber supplement, fiber gummies. Now over here on the right, if you see a hyphen, this means that these are very relevant words to your category and to your product, but you're not indexing for them. So I'm just going to scroll down. Let me open this up so we can see all of the words. Scrolling down, here we go. Your number 70 for colon cleanse, detox cleanse 198, 267. Wow, your organics really need improvement. When you see they're in the triple digits or even in the high double digits, it means your pages, pages, pages deep. So it can have a tremendous impact. So let's put this into context a little bit. So, okay, here we go. Um, I know you talk about colon cleanser and detox for weight loss. Okay, so it does say that in your title. Um, you are organically ranked 188, and there's 16,600 people looking for this on Amazon this month. So, of course, you're going to have all the sponsored ads that show up before you, and then the 187 other organic ads that are going to show up before you for the words colon cleanser on Amazon. Oh, you know what? Did I select the right one? Well, colon cleanser 9.274. So let's look at this colon cleanser. And okay, that is what I selected. Um, this is so interesting. So $9.274 million. And where you're ranked, you've got to ask yourself, is the organic rank of 188 sufficient enough to get your fair share of this revenue, especially since some of the sellers are getting over a million dollars of this themselves? And the answer should be no, right? So you definitely need to improve your organics. Now let's talk about competition. So I found this listing um, by taking the words uh, natural detox from your title and found this listing here. Now I'm not doing any product comparisons, but what I do want to show you is their advertising plan. So they are killing and they've got a tremendous amount of sponsored keywords. Even if they didn't have the sponsored keywords, let's negate that. If they just had their organic keywords, they would still sell more than you because you have so few keywords. Um, look, they've sold over 5,100 units this past 30 days and you're not at 400 yet. So their advertising is working. And quite frankly, they're, they're, they cost quite a bit more. So I would definitely broaden your reach with your keywords. Now, let's talk about organic. So we break up SEO into three phases here at My Amazon Guy. And in phase three, we look at those words where you're ranked in spots 20 through 50. Right now, you've got 123 of them. And because of that, you're really not benefiting from that organic traffic. So our focus would be to lift you up in the ranks so that instead of being in spot 20, six for detox juice cleanse, right? We'd have you in the top 10. And that goes for all of these keywords. So imagine the traffic and the sales that you would get as a result of that. Now coming over here to your listing, and by the way, it's the words that get your listing above everybody else's and the search results. And then it's the look, the appearance and your product that creates conversion once someone clicks on your image. Now coming through, I'm going to go through your images. Who is your demographic? Is it a man? Is it a woman? An athlete, elderly, middle-aged child? You want to see them in your image. Also, I don't know what this looks like. So um, it would be nice to see it mixed in a uh, 
a drink somehow, some way that would definitely shoot. Even if you're able to put this into a smoothie or drink it, you know, <clears throat> chug it before, you know, a meal or something like that. But you definitely need to see the product, right? I see the packaging, but let's see the product too as well. Um, and I do recommend video with a couple of, so two lifestyle images, two infographics and video. That's what you're missing out on. Your title looks good. Coming down here, okay, this is why. So your bullets need to go up to 250 characters each and make sure that you're integrating these frequently used words into your bullets and your title regularly. Um, scrolling down here, I just wanna see if you've got any A plus content, you don't. Um, brand registry would help too as well. So let's look and see um, what's going on in here. If they, ah, uh, see, so because of this, they are indexing for far more organic traffic than you were. I apologize about that. So listen, here at my Amazon guy, we are a 300 person full service Amazon agency, and we manage over 250 brands, giving our clients peace of mind, knowing Amazon is handled so they can focus on their business. Love an opportunity to chat with you. So click the link in my email that reads book a call, snag yourself a free consultation. And once you do that, I'll email out the competitive analysis. But thanks so much for watching. Look forward to speaking with you soon. Take care.